Hi, I'm Steph Horton, captain for the Women's England and Manchester City football team. Becoming a team can be confusing time in any girl's life, and that's why I'm supporting the Let's campaign to give you one less thing to worry about. Find out more at becomingateam.co.uk. Of course, you're going to be a little bit anxious and a little bit nervous about how your body is changing, and I was no different, I think. Obviously you notice your boobs are growing or you're growing hairs on your legs or under your arms, I think. You do get a little bit scared and obviously you don't really know how to approach it and I was quite fortunate that I had my mum that was really supportive. I didn't suffer with spots, uh, my body didn't generally change quite a lot, I think. I was quite flat chested and I think that's probably down to playing a lot of sport at the time and I think for me it was just trying to probably control your emotions and trying to get yourself um, not upset as easy and angry and um, I think for me that's probably what I found a little bit difficult because you sometimes there was no reason for it it would just happen and there was nothing major that happened but the smallest of things would be something to set us off or a chance to maybe have a discussion or argue but um, I think looking back now I think that's that that was my my change in puberty was changing how I thought and how I felt at the time. I actually remember quite clearly, I think we were over the local park and uh, one of my best friends, had, she was maturing a lot earlier than me and she was on about going on about shaving her legs and shaving under her arms and you kind of think, why, why am I not doing that now? And I know I remember that and going back to my mum and just saying, mum, my best mate, um, shaving her arms and legs, can I not do it? And she's like, right, okay, we'll go and get you. I think it was like a little electric razor that you can get from Boots or something. and. Uh, we'll go and get you one of them and we can start at the weekend when you're off school and I think it was just all about talking it through and she was quite open to doing that and I think she was quite happy that I went and approached her rather than waiting for her to come and speak to me. A strange experience, I think uh, it was my mum that first said right okay let's go and get you fitted for some bras and I remember just going into town in Sunderland and um, I can't remember which shop it was, but I remember just going and get a few t-shirt bras for when, obviously in secondary school, for underneath your shirt and the everyday clothes. And uh, yeah, it was my mum that was like, right, come on, it's time to go and get some now. Mm -hmm.